All right, so it's mid-July. The heat is starting to get pretty brutal, so we just went through our squash patch and picked the rest of what we could find out there. Some of them got torched by the sun, but ultimately it won't matter because we can grind it up and the tortoises will still enjoy it. Some of them that are whole we'll use for us and we'll have for dinner. But right now, I'm going to show you all the harvesting process for some leeks. We've been growing these for a few months now. Started just from seed. And then there's a video either on my mom's channel or my dad's channel. I'll have to find it and link it in the comments below. Where basically they just pounded a metal pole into the ground to create a bunch of uniform holes. And then stick the little leek plant inside and let it grow from there. So this is probably after we've harvested about half of them, if I'd have to say. It's pretty dense in here originally. They're around two feet tall at the moment, but they're delicious. We've been using them to make dips and soups and all sorts of fun stuff. So I'm going to harvest a few and show you all how they look. Yeah. That pumpkin's beautiful. Yeah, arrange it on you like you do. All right, I'm going to harvest this guy. Looks like a big one. Woo! And I love the tops because it almost looks like a cartoon character that's been like electrocuted or something. <laughs> but you can eat all this. So this part down here is like the more white root part and then the green leaves, we're gonna pull off the ones that are dried up here. But I personally wash this whole thing and chop it up and put it into soups so and I think it's delicious. I don't know if everyone eats the green parts or primarily just the bottom part here, but super delicious and pretty big, if you can't tell. Longer than my arm pretty much. Slow so they don't rip off. Yeah. There we go. Yeah, very good. The farthest away one, yeah. Delicious.